Hi, we're going to talk about the different types of business organizations. One of the types of business organizations is sole trader. It is an organization owned and controlled by one person only, so it's easy to set up. In a sole trader business, the owner has unlimited liability. It means that a sole trader could lose all his or her possessions to pay off any business debts in times like bankruptcy. A sole trader might also lack capital. If their business is successful and they're willing to expand it, it requires more money to do so and sole traders have often used up all their savings starting up in a business and are often unable to raise debt finance. A sole trader may employ other people in the business. However, it will still have only one owner. A sole trader can also interact with their customers, meaning they can have personal contact with them. In conclusion, a sole trader business is easy to set up and the owner gets to control everything, but they may lack capital and the owner has full responsibility over their business. Another type of business organization is partnership. A partnership is a business owned more than one person, usually two to a maximum of 20 people. Like a sole trader business, it's easy to set up. However, they will need to have agreements on finance and how they will run the business. Profits will be shared as well. There will be less burden in a partnership business since partners are able to share ideas and help one another. However, partnerships lack capital compared to joint stock companies. Most partners are general partners who share unlimited liability. However, it is also possible to have some limited partners with limited liability. A sleeping partner will provide money to the partnership in return for a share of the profits, but they are not involved in the management of the organization. Partners can bring new skills and new ideas to the business as well. However, partners might disagree. In conclusion, a partnership business is easy to set up. Partners bring more ideas and skills, but partners might disagree and profits are shared. Private limited company is another type of business organization. It has one or more shareholders. An example of a private limited company is 12 cupcakes. In a private limited company, there will be more finance and more ideas. Unlike a sole trader and a partnership, private limited companies has limited liability. Private limited company is harder since it is required to disclose financial information. Private limited companies can only sell shares to people known to the existing shareholders. In conclusion, there is more capital and ideas in private limited companies, and it has limited liability. But financial information is required and they cannot sell shares publicly. The next business organization is public limited company. It has at least two shareholders and unlike private limited companies, public limited companies can sell shares to any individual or organizations on the stock market through a stock exchange. Just like private limited companies, public limited companies has also limited liability. However, public limited companies are expensive to form. It is also required by law for a public limited company to publish detailed annual reports and accounts. Created using Powtoon.